Hello students, this is Vidal teacher. Today we will understand a new topic in English grammar for standard 3. Lesson number 10, There and There. There and there are homophones. They sound the same but have different meanings. The word there talks about the existence of things or the position of things. The word there indicates position of things. Position means something that belongs to a group of people. There, it is used to show place. With the help of various examples, we will now learn the correct use of the word there in given sentences. Where is the cat? There it is. It's on the table. There you are. I was looking for you everywhere. There is a slide in the park. There are lots of children in my class. There tells us something belonging to them. With the help of various examples, we will now learn the correct use of the word there in the given sentences. The boys are riding their bikes. Tom and Jenny live here. It is their house. The hens are sitting on their eggs. Now let us revise what we have understood today. Are you ready? Okay, let's get started. Fill in the blanks with there or there. Dash our flowers in the garden. Children, what will be the correct answer? Yes, there are flowers in the garden. The birds are flapping dash wings. Come on children, give me the correct answer. Yes, the birds are flapping their wings. Dash are lots of animals at the zoo. Yes, there are lots of animals at the zoo. Where are the boys? They are over dash playing on dash bikes. Come on children, give me the right answer. Yes, they are over there playing on their bikes. Well done children. Wasn't it fun to do this activity and give correct answers? I hope you enjoyed today's class and understood the topic. Keep learning and keep growing. Thank you.